Hello, my uh, my name is Pete Dickey. Yes, it's a funny name. Um, pretty easy to remember though, which is uh, which is good. It is uh, 2012, and um, today's episode, I am going to show you um, my personal opinion of uh, the top ten horror movies. And since I'm only 13, I'm these movies are newer. Like uh, they're most of them are in the 2000s um but there you'll you'll get the old the 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 occasional the occasional um old movie but anyways uh i got six of my top movies that i'm going to show you um but i'm going to count down i'm going to start at number six which is a uh, it was my first horror movie, and it still stands pretty high on the list. It is called The Grudge, and it is a 2007 movie, and it was terrifying. Um, it's it's about some old grudge, and uh, and it had to do with love and madness, and then everything. It was it was really, 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 really scary. Uh, here's the picture, the title cover here. Uh, it's it's just a girl looking um, looking at you in this creepy way, and yeah. So uh, that is number six for sure. And then number five is um uh, is an older movie. It came out in 1990. Uh, it's called The Night of the Living Dead. But uh, keep in mind that is not the old black and white version. It's uh, it's the remake, so it has colors, and um, it's a zombie apocalypse movie, and it scared the living crap out of me. Um, I saw it pretty recently. I think it's probably one of the oldest horror movies I've seen. And uh, here's the cover. It's a, it's a real classic too. Anyways, it's these people that um that just get caught in a zombie apocalypse and have no help. Anyways, that was, uh, that was really scary. And then, number five, number, sorry, number four. Um, this, it wasn't the scariest, but it had some nice suspense. And, um, uh, I found it quite scary. It's called The Mist. Um, it's a 2010 film. It's a Stephen King novel, which I'm a fan of. Um. Here's the cover. It's kind of blurry. It's just them standing in front of this big glass glass room uh, with mist coming in. And it's about these, this monster that comes in from the mist and it's killing a bunch of people. Yeah, uh, you should definitely check that one out. That was really good. It's a really long horror movie. It's two hours and six minutes. But anyways, that, that was really good and quite scary. Um, number three. This is a classic. It's a 2002 movie. It's called The Ring. Uh, sorry. It's 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 pretty scary stuff. I mean, like for uh, for a 2002 movie, it's a, it's a good idea. It's about a video that kills you when you watch it, and uh, that scared me. So here's its cover, which. Uh, yeah, and it was it was a good movie, but it was also pretty darn scary. Uh, number two, I don't have a picture of the cover unfortunately because I just watched it today. Um, it's it's a 2012 film. It's uh, it's very new. Uh, it came out this year, and it's in the num number one horror movie in the world right now. It's called The Woman in Black. Um, it's fresh in my mind, and it was it was a scary movie. I'll tell you that. Um. It, it was just, I can't even explain it. It was just really, really scary. And uh, I enjoyed it. It's complicated, so uh, you should watch it. It's an hour and 40 minutes. It's on demand, and I think it will be for a while with its ratings. And people really liked it. Um, my number one scariest horror movie right now is uh, also a 2012 film. It's still in theaters, I believe, and... It's another zombie apocalypse-ish movie. It's that type. And 
it's it's crazy. It's um it's it's called Chernobyl Diaries. It's full of action. It's uh it's about Chernobyl, which is a place and there was a big nuclear disaster there and um and they let these tourists in a long time after the disaster and these tourists are there and they have this thing to let them know if the radiation levels were high and there were these zombies but the zombies were caused from the radiation which happened during the disaster so they're not really zombies but they're like they're crazy and like eating eating these tourists and it's just a huge chase scene and lots of fun lots of pop outs it's it's really really scary like it was a good movie too it's 14a so you can check that out like a lot of these movies are 18a but um this one's 14a and it was it was it was really scary anyways um that's it i i suggest you sub subscribe my videos because i'm gonna be updating this list also often sorry i can't talk today i'm gonna be uh, updating this list often and um it's hopefully gonna be uh hopefully gonna be better movies in here by next week because i watch one almost every night and don't think these are the only six movies i've seen these are the six scariest and best that i've seen um but anyways yeah so um you can subscribe i got some funny videos some spoofs of horror movies I'm really a horror movie guy. If you like them, if you like horror movies, great. Just check out my videos. And I also have some non-horror movie related stuff. But anyways, uh, yeah, so um, uh, yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. All right, see you guys.